Vroom. What we got here today? Playing with some Legos. Well, maybe, but not exactly. We got ourselves a brand new Lego Pi 3 case. So, let's stop playing and take a closer look. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, so what we got here today is the Maker Fire Raspberry Pi 3 Pi Blocks Lego case. Pretty awesome stuff. So you see, I already got the Pi in here. We'll go ahead and disassemble this bad boy so you can see the insides and just see what to do. So this case is reasonably priced, I want to say. it's You can find it anywhere between 10 to 13 bucks. Link will be in the description for the company I purchased it from. I think it's pretty cool, you know. I, I really want to get my kids into using the Pi 3, um, using like the Pixel desktop and whatnot to do research and things like that and be able to use LibreOffice. So there's a lot of cool things we can do with the Pi besides just Retro Pi. But, you know, some of the cases just, you know, they're not so much fun, especially for a kid. So this is an awesome solution here. And, a, you know, a real deal Pi 3 case that's a Lego, essentially. So taking a look at her, we do have all of our ports accessible. So I'm kind of showing that here. We do have our SD card slot. Little recessed there. Looks like she should be good. We've got our all our ports, our USBs, our uh, GPIO. We also do have our display and camera ports accessible from the top as well. That's a nice little added feature. Some cool stuff you can do with that. So let's go ahead and open her up and pop in the pie and take a look. So when you put your pie into this, this little fella here, you see there's these two tabs on the side. You just have to make sure that you line that up with the holes on the actual board and then click it into place. And there still will be room to put heat sinks on if you so choose on the top there on the processor. So there's definitely room for that. I don't know about a fan, but definitely you got room there. So right here, I'm just showing that there are these tabs you have to click into place to make sure it closes all the way. Pretty, pretty awesome. But right here, you know, a little bonus. I think this is kind of cool. Even if I use this for myself, put a little treasure chest on there. Put a little Ninja Turtle to guard that, that treasure chest. But what do we got? Well, we have to do the ultimate test, right? Always have to do the ultimate test with a new case. So in my treasure chest here, I do have some micro SD cards. Hey, why not store some micro SD cards on your case? So let's go ahead and slide that bad boy in and see if she's easily inserted and removed. So easily inserted, obviously, hangs out a little bit. Awesome, that's what I'm talking about. We can easily remove an SD card. So. You know, what What makes this case so special? It's a, it's a Lego. It's a Lego case. You know, there's nothing fancy about it. It's a plastic case, but it's unique in that, hey, you could play with it. <laughs> you can make it your own. Your kids can, can have fun with this, you know, have something neat for their little setup. And, and, you know, play with your pie when you're not playing with your pie. You know what I mean? You can go ahead and, uh, oh, no, he just attacked... The Ninja Turtle guarding my SD cards. No! 